goes through the Reddit room. I did find it. I didn't odd read that it, and then we went started raiding after doing that. Yeah. <laughs> Does his face look like a fucking gore house right now? His face? No, like uh, the entire room. Does it look gory? Bits. 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 Uh, it's mostly scratches. Okay. Okay. Um... So she would look at him kind of silently at her. Uh, that feeling of malice has not gone away, just uh -huh. to let you know. Uh, it's not as overpowering as it was. It's You're like so fucking seething. Okay, cool. I mean, Quinn tricked him twice. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, Quinn did I don't know if I call that tricking him. She did trick him. Yeah, it was tricky. Mm -hmm. I think he just engaged in that phase. But that's pretty similar. Go on. Sorry. Um. Everything good? He tilts his head, looking down at the cards. Uh, he's got one in his hand. And he says, Hmm. No, I appear to have lost. And he picks them up and starts reshuffling them. Tone down your emotion, because it's kind of intense right now. He looks to you kind of confused, or not, not confused, more uh, curious. What do you mean? I mean, the overwhelming sense of malice coming from you that I felt in this nest. Like, the sides of his mouth kind of creep up into the smile. Uh, and he says... Yes, but how do you know that? <laughs> she looks a bit hurt, but like is trying to hide it as best as she can. Mm-hmm. That's it. Interesting. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. So, he stands up and he says, As you can see, no rats. And he kind of starts taking a couple steps towards you. Uh, she presses a bit harder. No rats at all. None at all. And everyone continues to try to piss me off while <laughs> about it. Sorry. <laughs> he basically comes up till he's standing kind of uh, in front of you. He's taller than you, so he's kind of looming above you a bit. Mm -hmm. Still with his kind of smile, the twitch, he's, he's twitching a bit with his eye uh, as he kind of leans down a bit and he says, I will do. Nothing while I'm on board. That was my deal. And once we get off, 
Olive upholded. What do you have to offer? You want. Do you know what is behind the door in the sanctuary, the one hidden by a tapestry? Uh, she immediately frowns. Well? There's not. Well? If you don't know, I have no use for you. He turns and starts walking back in more into the room where he was sitting. I want to know what is behind the door, who is behind the door, where is behind the door, basically everything about it. It was the one room I wasn't able to get into. I am very curious in nature. Only curiosity, and you do find a door after you it. Probably not. I have no interest in going to Mirai anytime soon. And in exchange, you will. I'll give you one. I think the information that I give you is both of His eyes turn more red and he starts to lose that smile. If I had been tricked once, I would agree, but twice, I will give you one. I already know which one you'll choose. This is something I would never anyone ever. I know what fair like I would not lie to one. Can you roll a persuasion? Oh boy. I'm fucking dying. Okay, like I. Oh, oh. oh. <laughs> Wait, can I interject for a brief second? Can Iris hear any of the conversation behind the door, or is it just like talking that she can't make? Roll a perception. If you're trying to ah! listen. <laughs> Fifteen. 
This is the shit. That's I a big no. <laughs> I love this shit so much. You can hear low murmurings, but not too much else. I'm fucking dying. Cypress tilts his head. And he says. No. Either. I will spare. How about this? Either I will never harm one of them. Or. Neither of them will suffer the consequences from this transgression. This transgression is twice correct. Yes. They will still have to <laughs> pay the piper. Fight me, bitch! <laughs> <laughs> but they won't suffer the consequences for the actual trickery. And you yes, from one? Yes. Well, from, as Iris so lovely put it, someone. As boring as she is. Better me boring. Perhaps. Are you offering that as the deal? Take up your offer, both of them not. And will you take that cost from the last agreement as well? Maybe not. A very wide toothy grin spreads across his face. Then it's a deal. I hate this! I'm dying! <laughs> Why are you? No! It's a deal. So first, tell me, what's behind the door? There is a sharp glint in his eyes. And he starts laughing, and it sounds like... Uh, it, it sounds like the scratching of those rat nails on the wood. Uh, as he kind of laughs. And he does this for like almost like a full minute before finally stopping. Yes. Before finally stopping, and he says, Oh, that is wonderful. And then he goes back to playing his card game. Dead. That's good. Oh, no, I definitely agree. And he keeps playing his card game. She ain't even trying to hide it this time. She just looks upset. He is smiling like he is enjoying every second of it. Uh, but he just stays sitting, playing his card game. He does not make any move to get up or do anything. Collect that kiss or anything? No. Second. Oh, I'll take that when I'm ready. She 
kind of glares at him, but doesn't say anything, and just kind of leans up against the door across for the rest of the time. I mean, you are one of the lost sisters. You, you will definitely live quite a while, so I have plenty of time. Just remember, uh, I get the first one. So however long that takes, shrugs. She presses her lips and doesn't speak. He keeps playing his card game, seeming much happier. Uh, that mouse he had is still kind of underneath, but he definitely feels victorious. Mm-hmm. She stays there for the rest of her watch until passing out to the next person. Thorns back up to her fucking crow's nest and sits there. Yay! Yay! <laughs> <laughs> hey, Nadinia, you don't have to French the rat boy anymore. Okay, but like we're gonna jump him and kill him, right? Like we just can't. Yeah, yeah. Like that's like a big. Yeah, I know. Like this is like... put the death <laughs> on him. <laughs> this has a hundred percent put the death mark on this man. This is worst case scenario. Uh, no, no, it's not. <laughs> I did this to avoid the worst case scenario. That's fair. Yeah, you you kind of dodged a bit of a bullet there. That's fair. No, I appreciate it very much, but like, also, hey, yeah. there's a god behind this cool door. Mm -hmm. Come at it. Like, I mean, it's bad. The Fae love to sell information. They do, and it's also an someone's evil gonna learn it. Mm -hmm. and they're not gonna, yeah. So um, we're gonna have to ice this fucker. They would also fucker. pull Quinn and Iris aside and tell them what the fuck happens at some point before. I feel like Iris would just scream and start babbling and pacing in circles. <laughs> Iris goes insane and leaves. Um, she doesn't mention taking the kiss deal, though. That's... You shouldn't have taken that. You should have just left it. Yeah. Yeah. It is someone boring. Who fucking cares? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I will say the person I had designated that he was going to go after would have upset you so much more, uh, Jamie. Who fucking was it? I found out. My sister? Maybe. Uh, but yes, so... we That was a retcon on the fourth day, so you're past that Sorry. No, it's all good. For the it's second all good. time. Fun time. Now go back to me crying in front of my brother's grave. Yay. Or something else. <laughs> oh, something else. Uh, okay, so recap. for is this recap, I'm going to attempt to do something. Okay. And it's terrible. No, it won't be. I think we should. Let her, let her, let her, let her, she might be terrible. I apologize. I d can't sing very well. So we'll see how this goes. I believe in you! Thank you. Y'all do. Do it. If it's bad, we'll just say it's good anyway. <clears throat> do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Okay. <clears throat> Shut up, Chris. Whatever you're gonna say, shut up. <laughs> Whatever you're gonna say, shut up. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Got him. <clears throat> when you call to me The ragged cliffs I scramble A single thread 
things went way down and I pray not now, not now. And I find you whole and woven, trying desperately to sew. I know the kindest thing is to leave you alone. We heard most of that. Good. <laughs> and also, hey, fuck you, your voice is adorable and you're great. Like, what the fuck? And you that was know. lovely. I'm not done! Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't think I've felt this alone since the Celestial Plane. I haven't... I haven't seen my clerics in a couple days. I miss them. I miss my star called. I miss... You would have loved to see these ships. You always wanted to fly. To leave Mirai. Nadine reminds me so much of you. And Quinn, oh, how can you look so similar? It's almost uncanny. You'd be so jealous of them. Traveling to another island. Even with... <laughs> I'm glad they safely made it to Echo. I just wish they had gotten a warmer greeting. Maple was able to reconnect with her old group and learned of quite a few new members, but also the loss of one. Now they have to plan out their next attack. Now figuring out where exactly the place is, but I worry about what dangers there are there. So far, so far away. I don't know if I can help. And there, that's the end of it. Can you write, put the song down in the chat or somewhere? Yeah. So I can read it. Thank you. Yes, yes, yes. Give me a second. Also, who? Is this someone that she knew before she came to Hmm. Perhaps Quinn's I'm father. fucking intrigued. Does this is fuck? No. Giant lady. Oh my god. Because it almost sounds like she's reminiscing about someone she loved. Mm hmm. There you go. That's the lyric she sang. Oh, uh, it looks like, yeah. That's really sad. Holy shit. Yeah. All right. You guys are in Echo. You currently had split up a bit. Mm -hmm. mm. Uh, you told Jack... Did you tell Jack the place you guys were going to go meet up at? Or no, you said we you'd call said him. We said we'd call him. We yes. still don't know, yeah. Yes. Uh, so you said you were going to call him to let him know. Uh, let's see, Kira went to the library by herself... Quinn went to go get meat because of the sad, sad meal that these uh, kids were having. Mm -hmm. Some potatoes. Whole potatoes. Soup. Boiled potatoes. Yeah, not peeled or anything. Or washed. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Nadinia was going crazy with her uh, cleaning magic. As she will probably continue to do. My new Hoover vacuum. Tyson. Uh, and Maple, you were with Sugar, who basically had run into your arms. Yep. And she has not spoken at all, but she's just been kind of clinging to you. Mm -hmm. uh, let's pick up with Maple. 
Um, how are you doing? Is there anything you want to do outside? What What is Maple going to do? Um, she's gonna be out there for. A while. Yeah. Yeah, she cries for a while. Eventually, starts like trying to come sugar. She doesn't. She keeps herself basically buried into you. Uh, if she's crying, you don't hear it, but she's definitely shaking. Uh, you can eventually kind of pull her enough away to look at her, and uh, she looks skinnier than you remember her being last time you saw her. Uh, and she's got just bags under her eyes, and her eyes are very red and puffy. She doesn't speak at all. She just kind of stands there, looks like she still wants to cling to you, but she's letting you push her away for just the moment. Okay. Uh, yep, she lets you... She... She weighs so much less than you remember her. Yeah. This is like minutes like Okay. Um I think at this point Quinn and Kira would both be gone and it would just be Nadine and Iris in there. Uh who was it? Rena is trying to cook the food. Uh, and you already see a bunch of the kids are standing awkwardly around her, very scared and frightened. Like, just clearly waiting to eat something. Mm -hmm. uh, a lot of them seem to be trying to avoid Nadinia. Because she is a giant pirate woman that came in here. And started. Uh, yeah. Loud and, yeah, loud and manhandling and magicking. Some of them. There's actually two that hid behind Iris. I'm I'm actually cleaning now, to my fullest extent, because <laughs> clean mode activated. Because uh, because I I recognize that the children are staying away from me, and so I said, Iris, babe. Iris, babe. Babe. Bathe. Oh. Like, oh. Oh, okay. Oh, Sorry. Yeah. I was like, what? Um, <laughs> God, no, I'm yeah. so dirty. Um, she wouldn't, like, force kids into a tub or whatever, but, like, she would definitely be, like, trying to, like, comfort them and just, like, assure them that, like, things are okay and, like, you know, like, she has a little sister. Like, she knows how to do that. Mm -hmm. Roll me a uh, persuasion. Things are not okay. Me rolling. Do you see all the see all the dirt on the ground? The ground is dirt. Do you see all the oh. dirt? Yes. Ah! 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 I use an Istus hack no. because I want these children to love me. Okay, I... it's, it's fine. I, okay. I Iris is having a bad fucking time. Fuck Echo. Fuck this place. <laughs> fuck. Oh. Uh, so you're you're trying to console these kids, but you've, I mean, you really haven't had a break in a while. Just like, you know, stuff kind of one after the other, and not to mention you're probably very worried about your sister right now, so you can't kind of give it your all. That's fair. So, you try, but you keep getting distracted, you keep thinking of other things, your worry kind of gets the best of you, so it's not really working. Makes sense. Yeah. So, 
Oh, yeah. I'm sure that being around all these kids makes you think of your sister, too. Yeah, and especially, like, I don't know, like, the, not to, you know, characterize myself or whatever, but, like, uh, knowing that what Cypress did was an illusion, I think kind of fucked with her, because, like, I think her hope was that, like, okay, like, at least she was alive mm -hmm. X days ago, and now that's gone, too. So mm -hmm. I think she's, like, you know, not... Yeah. Yeah. Poor Iris. Uh, but yes, so you walk into this scene, you don't see, uh, you don't see Kira or Quinn anywhere. And Nadine is thoroughly terrorizing the poor children. kind of walks in and stops. Like, there's, like, it's no display because her pale, pale skin is just her cheeks are red and her nose is red and, like, is puffy around her eyes. And she just kind of looks at Nadania. I don't think she notices cause, cause clean Pina hmm? I swear fucking is it if you keep cleaning if I keep cleaning what Okay, I'll leave. Sets down, sets down the makeshift broom that she made. Oh wait, no, she wouldn't use a broom. Sets down the boxes of crap that's been around the room. Looks at the children. See you all later. And leaves. Uh that pile of filth was my bed. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do you wait outside? Do you go somewhere in particular? No. Probably move a little ways and just sit down and just... Or lean up against something after cleaning it. And then... There's a stump outside. You can sit on that if you want. Okay, yeah, I'll just sit on the stump. I think, like, Iris would kind of, like, look up at Maple and, like, get hella concerned um, and kind of, like, go over to her and she'd be like, Maple, is, is, is everything okay? Do, do you need me? I don't know. I need right now. Where's Quinn and Um, Quinn went to go get food. Um, I'm not, I, I didn't see where Kira ran off to. She might be with him. Um, we can text them on their stone. Okay, why don't, why don't you sit down? I can, uh, start making something. I can make tea, uh, if there's tea around, there's or just get you. Ta, yeah, right. Teas are just leaves. I can go outside and pick a cool fucking leaf, and it might be lavender, and it'll be great. You don't want to pick anything off of anything. I, I, I want that to be an actual thing Iris just said. <laughs> <laughs> Iris aggressively makes tea. Rita looks at her like, we have this pot, and that's it. Okay. Never mind, no tea. Um, I can get you some water, or okay. or. Okay. Um. Then what what would you like me to do, for you? Just you, you know wh whatever you need. Just just let me know. Um. Um. She's kind of 
stares at you for a bit, like, thinking. Yeah. And she just kind of slowly shakes her head. See, I'm torn. I'm, I'm torn because Iris's instinct is to give her a hug, but like that might go very poorly knowing Maple. So I Maybe. don't. You could offer one. But it's, but is that weird? Do people say that in real life? You know, it's yes. not. It's not real life. Okay. Yes. Um, no. I I don't like hugs as a person, but okay. Um. Do you, would you like a hug, maybe? Kind of bites down on her lip and gives a very, very small She gives her the biggest hug and the, the most, like, warm and, like, comforting, like, I'm fucking here for you kind of hug that she can muster. I want a hug, but okay. <laughs> you feel a uh, very light resistance as something's trying to push against you? Oh, I open it up for sugar. I don't care. Like, come on in. No, no, come no. She's up. pushing against you. Yeah, she doesn't oh. be near her. Oh. And I'm still holding her. She's not strong. So, I mean, if you're not paying attention, she can't push you away. You would just feel oh, it. Oh, I mean, if she, like, if she, like, is, like, not part of this, then Iris would back off immediately for sure. Like, not making that worse. Yeah, I mean, you can hug her without hugging sugar if you do it from like the side but sugar does not want any part of this more like you're a stranger i don't know who you are don't touch me that's really fair she'll like she'll like do side hug then and just like very softly just try and like I don't know, be encouraging, like, Michael, I, I know it's, it, it's been a lot right now, but we're here for you, we, we love you, and we're, we're going to get you through this, whatever happens, um, you know, just, you don't have to go it alone, we're here, if you need us, and, and if you don't, that's okay too, but right. just, okay. what? And she just looks up at you, and now there's, like, just pure anger on her face. Sorry, I as Marissa didn't hear what you said because you cut out, and I'm very sorry. I'm going to fucking kill him. Uh, you mean Cypress? No. And who's in charge of the Avon company? I'm going to rip his fucking throat out. Iris kind of has like a very like mirthless grim smile and she says, oh, 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 um, oh, 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 what the fuck? I will hold him down. <laughs> only, only if you let me help. Obviously. Hot. Murder couple! <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna kind of look down at Sugar. This is Iris. She looks up just very barely uh, and glances at you, Iris, and then goes back to burying her face. You're my real mom. That's fair. Iris does look kind of horrifying a little bit. <laughs> this child looks very underfed. Do I have extra food? Like, can I just start being like, here's some- You have food. rations. Yeah, I divvy that shit out. Here, have some sourdough. Oh, you what? get- kids swarm you. Yeah. 
I I was they devour good you. food. Yeah. yeah, I know. I was about to have you come back with that. Uh, the kids fucking just swarm you the second you start pulling out food. I try and make sure everyone gets some, if that's at all possible. Yeah. I mean, you would have had rations for a couple days, so you can at least divvy up a little bit for everyone. Yes, please and thank you. Yes. Uh, at that time, Quinn, you get back? Yeah. Uh, if you want to just knock off the silver, uh, I'll say you've gotten... What type of meat did you want to grab? Uh, I wanted to get... I mean, I don't know what's in the area. Probably, like, deer. Right? The yeah, there's a lot of venison. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I have some venison. Uh, and then... I think he also got, like... Two baker's dozen of some kind of sweet bread. Type okay. thing. Uh, there are honey pecan rolls that are really popular here. Yeah, he'll get some of those. Yes. Uh, so pecans are amazing. So you can shut up. Uh, so you walk in, you have, uh, as these kids are swarming ours, you walk in with fresh meat and sweets. I'm holding, I, when I walk in the door, the sweets are already over my head. Like, I am not, mm -hmm. <laughs> this is going to be shared <laughs> properly. No, just swarming the one-armed man. Uh, <laughs> uh, you, I will say you pass by Nadinia coming in. You get kicked out or just get overwhelmed? Kicked out. Okay. Yeah, that Have fun. Yeah. And then. I probably try to enlist Iris to hand out the rolls while I get the meat prepared to throw in the basic bitch stew. Mm -hmm. Did you get any other vegetables? Because they just had potatoes. Uh, yeah, I think I said I was getting more vegetables, too. Okay. People will come over to help you make it. Still carrying sugar. Mm -hmm. Rin looks actually kind of I guess impressed like there is relief and there is like actual like oh like that's actually really nice calories <laughs> she says I don't have anything to cut that up with I mean I guess I have a dagger <laughs> Maybe I've, I've got a dagger too but it's less likely to be quiet as grimy right now. Oh, I have, I have cooked utensils. Huh? I have cooked utensils. That's the thing I have. Yeah, I'm no, a cook. You do have it. Cool. I, I, I knew one of us had it. Yay! Alright. I pull out my cooking supplies and I begin to make a meal for these children. Alright. Uh, nice. So go ahead and roll your cooking utensils with advantage. Okay. What? Uh, Wisdom. Wisdom. Oh, that that's a great one that I should always use. Mm -hmm. oh! oh! Hell yeah. Hell yeah. So, Damn. While, while you were out, you were pretty smart, and you actually picked up some seasoning, too. Not a ton. You don't need, you know, a ton for just one meal. Uh... But you flavor this, uh, and the kids are, like, huddled around you guys, just wide-eyed, staring. It smelled like you made this whole, you know, small area smell absolutely amazing uh, as you're getting this stew cooking. It doesn't take too long to get it ready. Uh, they have... 
they kind of have a collection of small bowls, not really spoons, just bowls, cups, anything that they could kind of steal. Mm -hmm. uh, so the kids grab those, and they're all just, like, pressed up, like, shoving these bowls as close to you as possible for you to fill up their bowls with. Uh, and as you dish it out, each of them either gives you a nod or manage, some of them even manage to kind of whisper or mutter out a thank you uh, as they like rush back to their corner with their sweet roll and their stew and they just dig in ferociously. So, uh, where the fuck is Kira? Yeah, she wasn't Nope. I pull Sorry, off my phone I... and start texting Kira, Kira like, question mark, where the fuck you, you at? I don't remember <laughs> if I... I know I told somebody. I think you told Iris. I yeah. thought you told Nadinia. I, I, I would be wrong, said, I'm going if, to the library and everyone... If you, and if you recall, <laughs> I was, I was sleep also. hallucinating and True. it was a bad yeah. time. You are. Last time. So that could be my bad. I mean, we could okay. just say maybe you told someone, but both Nadine and Iris were busy, That's so they can hear you. Fine. Um, they goofed. That sounds like something she would do. 100%. I'm leaving. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, I, te I text Kira, but hey, ho, where are you at? Call me a ho. <laughs> no. <laughs> Shed. Hey, uh -oh. why didn't Cypress want to kiss you? Hmm? Who'd you kiss? Huh? Oh my God. Wow. <laughs> wow. Where'd you go? <laughs> okay. Go and get more um, kisses? <laughs> so, I probably am doing stuff now. Huh? Your phone rang in the library. It's super awkward. I don't know. What have I found so far? Uh, what exactly were you looking for again? Oh, fuck. Um... <laughs> <laughs> I'm it sorry. Chat. It was a lot of awful. stuff. Um, Did you write it down? No, I meant to watch the bot, but I forgot. Oh, did you check your books? Uh, no. Check your books. <laughs> Pat, Pat, you're fine. I just remembered to. Really have. Hold on, I have to read all my books first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I should grab my pat pat and put it in the Discord. I'm so sad I couldn't pat the seal. You can. He was, but he you, was really upset. <laughs> you can if just the targeting on console is shitty. Oh, for sure. It's super shitty. It's super shitty. I was watching you struggle go, oh, I wish I could help, but I don't know. Yeah, no, I'm definitely gonna try to take my keyboard and mouse downstairs later and I hope me see going how that... around and killing everything was fine. I hope you got everything still. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you did, because I was in the same part. I... It didn't pop up that I was getting XP, but when I looked down, I was a high... or level... I was up a level, so I guess okay, so something okay. happened. Okay, I don't see anything new. Um, okay, good. Okay, fuck. So, I have to go through all the fucking notes that are... Oh, fuck, it's mine. It's mine. Okay, so, um... The Yellow Throne. Mm-hmm. Um, the One True King, I think it was? Yes. Uh... God, so much fucking stuff. Um, the it's yellow fine. sign, if it's anyway, they're probably the same thing. Um, that's what I typed out that you wanted to find. Thank you. Because Thank you. Magic I knew someone wrote it down somewhere, and I was like, oh yeah, I don't know. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> 
Just orphans? <laughs> what is an orphan? What is an oh, orphan? No. <laughs> I think that was the joke I was making, yes. <laughs> what the context of that was. You know what? Oh, no, I'm just probably... harassing you. <laughs> uh. <laughs> it was probably um, like locations of orphanage here for like trying to see Avon come. Yes, it was. Sea curses. Sea. Like the, the ocean? The ocean. Yeah. Yes. He's curses to do with the, the sea. Ah. The, that, that'd be the yellow sign. Um. God, I'm trying to remember all the other stuff I'm trying to learn about right now. Um, what um, about that one book about the dragons and bullshit that you got? Your grandpa? The dragons? Um, Dragon bullshit book? So it was like a black leviathan or something like that. I don't know what oh. it was. Yeah, oh, that was from Submarine. That one. Yes. Yeah, um, I, I mean, if anything is mentioned about that, it'd probably be. Nicola, this is also coming from that, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. Yes. Also, like the god, the reflected gods, and. Okay. Roll me an investigation. Um. God, I, I feel like I'm missing something. Um. You can always come back. Say that. I don't know how long we're gonna be here. We can always come back. God damn! Why am I so fucking stupid? We've been rolling like ass today. Like yeah, you have. Ah. Uh, okay. Um, you don't find really any of that because that's all very specific and hard to find stuff. Okay. Um, maybe um, someone that don't will be there during the day. I don't know. But. I will give you, when you are walking past, uh, kind of like the children's section, uh, you see a book that has... Oh, damn it, what? I remembered that I was going to use before and talk this roll. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no. uh, But you see a picture of someone that looks like Cypress on the front of a book. Okay. Um, oh, yeah, that is another thing I want. Oh, my God. I'm a fucking mess. Um, yeah, you want the book called Baby Magic for Babies? <laughs> Sorry, I'm switching meds, so it's like, what's happening? I mean, you can get that for Nadinia. <laughs> um, honestly, good idea. Um, <laughs> if, well, if that's the only book I find in my first visit um, on Cyprus or Rat. Yeah. You 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 want to go pick it up? Yeah. All right. It is a children's illustration book uh, about the Pied Piper. Of course it does. And it tells the legend that you know of. Well, Kira wouldn't know of it, but right. uh, I know. yes. Fucking terrifying. Um. Yeah, the illustrations are actually, while they're abstract, they're kind of eerie. Mm. Think like a Tim Burton esque drawings for oh, them. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Um, hell yeah, but in a way, no. Oh, also, did anyone tell me that you guys pissed him off? No. No. Thanks, guys. Um, uh, like oh. they have the picture of the kids drowning. The faces of the kids are haunting. Okay. Um,. I'm going to leave the book here. Um, but now I am armed with more knowledge about how fucking awful that this um, potentially real storybook character is about. And that they're dangerous. More. Um, I guess I'd also look for history on Avon, the plant, and portals. I don't know. Uh, for the Avon, I mean, this is the town that the Avon company's from, so you can find uh, quite a bit about that. Okay. Um, the company or the plant? Uh, more... Oh my god. Quinn! <laughs> okay, you are in a different country with space shit, and you just wandered off. Yeah. <laughs> the wall blocked your way. Sorry, I was busy reading like three other things at the same time. Um, <laughs> uh, 
What did you say, Alicia? Uh, were you looking at the Avondale Vine or Sorry. Avon the company? Uh, well, at this point, both. Mostly the Vine. Uh, uh, because, like, hey, understanding what, like, how can it affect living things the way that it, we've seen it in its natural form? Um, there are plenty of books on druidic research here. There's like actually basically a whole wing just dedicated to druidic research. So there's plenty in there for you. Um, there's one book that you can find pretty easily that just breaks down every part of the vine, like stem, roots. Mm -hmm leaves every single part of it uh different ways that it's applicable to magic and all that kind of stuff uh right. and for the company there is a good section on the Avon company but most of it is dry uh like reports that have to be made public right uh newspaper clippings about them uh there's a couple books just about the founder of Avon, uh, kind of his contributions, uh, just general history on the company. <laughs> okay. Um, eventually, while I'm enraptured in this, I'll notice that my phone is doing something. Uh, at that point, uh, I'll text back. I went to the library. I thought I told you guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, she would not say you guys. She'd probably say you all. Uh, he'll probably be like, okay, I'll join you in a bit. Don't wander off and not respond. Bud. Bud. Sorry. Okay. Great. That 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 gets that out of that that. Um <laughs> Yeah, so I guess I find the Pied Piper. Yep. That's it for now. Yep, Pied Piper and then just general uh books about the vine and uh the avon company but nothing too in depth mm -hmm. okay uh do, do, do. nadini are you leaving yep all right uh are you gonna tell anyone or are you just heading out nope all right uh, so you just head out. Mm-hmm. Okay. Is Nadine good with directions? She's all right. Okay. Oh my god, She's Quinn's some... one of those people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, basically. Uh, Nadine, can you roll me a d100, please? She's got a, She's got proficiency in survival, if that means anything. Okay, uh, as you are walking along, uh, you get to a part of the sidewalk and suddenly you like step down and your foot just kind of like... Your foot meows. Yeah, you weird. stepped on a cat. It's really, it's <laughs> terrible. How could you? Yes, yes, you did. I know. You just finished your food, so you're starving. Uh, you step down onto the sidewalk and your foot like goes in a bit uh, basically the sidewalk kind of squishes with your foot this is a cobblestone path and for the next uh, about half a mile the sidewalk is squishy It like squelches as you walk on it, and other people okay, are walking on it, and they seem pretty 
Can I help you, sir? <laughs> what? Uh, 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 I, I don't know if you can help me. I'm sorry. <laughs> Not you. But you knew that. Uh. Yes, it squelches as you're walking. Uh, the other people seem annoyed, but not really surprised. Oh, the floor's gooey again. A guy's trying to pull a cart, and it's just fucking stuck. And he's just, like, cursing and kicking at the ground. Maybe we shouldn't, you know have I don't know squishy floors or something it's almost as if that's just an inconvenience yeah it's almost like this is echo and it is an entire inconvenience in its entirety <sighs> anyways I will I will deal with it as I walk as much as I possibly can. I. It probably is pretty difficult with the peg leg. Uh, I use my harpoon as. You can fly. Like, yes, <laughs> but I don't want to use it here. I don't know who's really watching. Okay. And there's fey people here, and they're all, like, weird and stuff. And they might try Rude. to take my socks. Wow. Rude. Am I wrong? I'm a fey person. Am I wrong? Will they not try to take my socks? <laughs> that sounds so funny out of context. <laughs> <laughs> you sound like an old man on the street. Yeah, one a of them. Well, they'll they'll, they'll yeah. steal your socks. Well, one of Nadine's best friends is a fae. Still I can't yeah. be racist, I'm, my best I'm, friend is a fae. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, can you put that as a possible title? <laughs> I can't be racist, one of my friends is a fae. <laughs> God. She would, never say, she would never say something like that. Which out loud. Yeah. Out loud. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but yeah, you can use your javelin to kind of help out with it. Uh, it's still annoying as all hell. Mm -hmm. uh, and when it switches to being cobblestone again, it's probably a bit jarring for you. Uh, but other than that, you don't have any other uh, anything else that pops up while you're walking got it uh you find the winking lizard pretty easily uh it's got like a giant taxidermy lizard on top of it uh that's winking so it's not too hard to miss got it and inside is mostly full of like sailors and docks people and you know definitely a bit more of a rough and tumble crowd so hmm does it look like there's any uh what's the word I'm looking for Does it look like there's any rideable creatures around? I know that's a very odd thing to ask. Yeah. Yeah, that is. Like, in oh, the building? No, 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 no. I mean, like, before I entered the place. Uh, yeah, there's a stable that has some pegasi in it. Okay, and it, is it just Pegasi, or is there, are there, Pegasi like... Pegasi and one wyvern. Okay, cool. So it's they're... a very small wyvern. It looks like a baby. Does it look, like, stabled? Stabled? Or is it just, like, hanging out there? 
doing whatever it wants. It's, they're all in a stable. Okay. All right. You win this round. What are you doing? I wanted to go touch a wyvern. That's <laughs> that belongs to somebody. I mean, you could go touch it. But it belongs to someone, and I'm a nice person. What the fuck? So I'm if it was to... just out on the street, but still, like, your your logic in this is astounding. But go ahead. <laughs> no, you gotta remember. So you gotta remember. Yeah. This is Nadinia. This is Nadinia we're talking about. So what what did we do with the dog that we found lying around in the street? Oh, it's adorable. I want it. I honestly feel like Nadinia is starting to become a parody of herself. Yeah. All right. All right. I'm sorry. I'm in a I'm in a weird headspace because I'm angry at everybody, and I'm um, trying to think. Sorry. No, sorry. it's not. It's not. It's not you guys. It's. Hold on. I'm gonna go pet the wyvern because I like I like flying animals. Okay. Uh, the baby Is gets it... excited when you come near it. It's like wiggling its whole body. Is it doing? Is it doing like? Steal. Like, no. See, see. No. <laughs> no. You, it. you cannot steal. Because it could be from a fae, and then you're fucked. Um. No, I'm not going to steal the wyvern. I am going to try to throw it some rations or something. No, wait, that'd probably get it fat. I'd do it anyways. <laughs> I should say it's like it's it is young to like teenish, so it's not rideable yet, but it's not like baby baby. Okay, so it's like it's 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 like a cult. Yeah. Essentially. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, so, like, I could probably carry stuff, but, mm -hmm. you know. Uh, Delivering yearling. Yeah, so it, it, like, its whole its whole body is wiggling when you come up to it, and it starts, like, catches. Oh my god. snapping its jaw as you approach. Like, uh, I can't think of a good alternative, but it's not, like, aggressive. Happy mm -hmm. uh, Yeah, just Happy excitement. Uh, you toss it some of your rations. It, like, stands up on its hind legs, and it, like, snaps them out of the air. Oh, that's awesome. And it, like, it's wiggling. It, like, rubs up against the side of the uh, staple where you're at. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna... I'm gonna pet it for a little bit, and then I'm gonna realize where I am and what I was supposed to be doing, and then... Uh, as you're petting it, it does, like, nip at you a bunch. Mm -hmm. Like a like a puppy would. Where it's not trying to be, you know, it's not trying to hurt you, it just... It's a wyvern. Yeah. So it nips at you a bunch, it doesn't draw any blood or anything like that, but it does, you know, it it hurts a little bit. It does exactly what I want it to. Which is play. Yeah. So yeah, uh, no, that's that's fine. I, I that's I, I realize like in it, after a few moments, oh, I'm supposed to be going inside and meeting um uh Jack, so I need to I need to stop playing. But I love you, Wyvern baby. It, you hear this whining noise as you leave. No wait, don't do this. Please shut. Wait, don't do this. You can't do this to me. You're not allowed. You're not allowed to make me feel bad that I'm leaving. Alright. I feel it's bad. For sale. I feel bad that I'm leaving, but I'm gonna go inside, and I'm gonna I'm gonna as soon as I see Jack, I have a simple question to ask him. Okay. Uh, you see Jack? He is playing darts at the moment. <gasps> Jack. Oh, and he misses the target. 
Oh, hey, hey, Nadinia, what, what's up? Glad you can make it. Buy me a wyvern. I'm sorry, what? That wasn't a question. Oh my god. Is that a drink? I need a wyvern. Like the the lizard? I I I I I grab his I grab his hand and like pull him outside and show him the baby wiz wyvern. I want it. I want the I, I don't want this one because this probably belongs to someone, but like where do we find one of these? Uh he you 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 pull him out of there and the barkeep kind of yells at you cuz he already has a tap going. Mhm. Mm uh Jack yells back at him to shut up and he'll be back. Uh you pull him out to look at the wyvern and he's like I mean, yeah, he is really cute. It's not a cat or anything, but like... I mean, I like more than cats. I like cats a lot, but I do like more than just cats. But yeah, I need one. <laughs> and... Because, because, because clearly I need one. And... Those are really expensive, you know that, right? Oh. Um. How much is one? Uh, a couple hundred gold, depending. Oh. Well. Fuck. Hey, real quick, where's your, uh, Where's your mark of Vistas? It's on your hand, right? Everybody's mark is on their hand, right? Yes. Yes. I thought. Yes. He reaches into his pack, fumbles around for a bit, and pulls out a pair of gloves. Mm -hmm. He's like, put these on. All right. They're put a bit too the big for you. He says, all right. So, uh, they're playing poker in there. slow smile on her face <laughs> crawls and says and says let's go have some fun yeah yeah i was thinking that all right let's jump to someone else while you <laughs> horribly abuse it's this is present <laughs> we're pirates what do you want from us uh iris and nadinia was there anything that you guys wanted to do give me maybe nadinia I said Nadinia, I'm sorry. I met Maple. Um, I think Iris would just be, like, trying to help coordinate, like, food distribution and, like, just trying to, like, if she sees something that needs to be done, just go, like, fucking help with it and just try to be, like, a calming Zen mom presence. I will tell everyone. you, it's getting kind of late. Like, it's around 10-ish. Yeah. Bedtime stories. Need to go find a place. Uh, so yeah, they, I mean, the kids, the kids do not fight over the food. Like, yes, they push and try to get it and they come up for seconds a lot, but none of them are trying to steal or take from the others or like be dicks about it. Like, Yes, they're hungry and starving, but they're not. There's camaraderie between them. That's what I'm trying to get at. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, you sure. notice. Make sure Sugar eats. Uh, she does not. She refuses. The goddamn food, child. Why not? She doesn't speak. She just buries her head in and doesn't move. You need to eat. Uh, Salt runs over to you. Can I have a food? No. Oh, come on! Can I have a food? Her food. Her food. 
I thought I heard oh, she's a. She's not gonna eat it. I'm gonna that. make her eat it. She hasn't eaten like barely anything since, you know. I can feel that. Can I have her food? No. <sighs> Oh, fine. Rena lets me have her food. Probably why she's not eating that. She's not eating, but she's a baby. Yes. I give her a warning glance. A one that she is very familiar with. She backs up a bit and just steals another roll and runs off. That's not how that works. <laughs> Sugar's a brat. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna, even if it's a few bites, I'm gonna try to make her eat. Uh, roll persuasion. Again. Okay. Do you have a better treat? Nope. I mean, no. I have deception, but. You can get her to drink some water, but she she doesn't eat anything. Hey, time to get some potions that have some magic bullshit in it. She gets nutrients. <laughs> Magical boost. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <You're> like... <laughs> if, she drink, if she's drinking, then... And then I'll... If, it's, if, if she's, like, not eat it at all, then I'll give it to Uh, salt takes it right away. <clears throat> I also, told you. She like rolls her eyes. Goes over to Ren. Yeah, she uh, she is scarfing down her food. Mm -hmm. uh, she waited till all the kids ate and till most of them got seconds before she died any herself. Mm -hmm. She doesn't even, like, she looks up at you, but she does not stop, like, mm. hoovering. Yeah. So, we got some shit to handle before. I will probably be back here every night. You guys have food. Uh, meantime, she takes out her gold pouch, and she has it, like, divided into... 50 gold each, and she gives her. You hand her the 50 gold, and she looks shocked. I mean, that's more gold than she's ever seen. Yeah. She kind of looks at you and looks back at it, and she pockets it very quickly. Yeah. Uh, Should last a few days, hopefully. Piece that you can think of. If there's anything else you need, let me know. I'll probably get my hand. She nods and you. When you you can hate me, that's fine. I left and I abandoned you, and this happened. It's a hundred. I don't think there's anything I could do to make it for any of this. As you say that, Sugar kind of grabs more at you. Uh, Rena just, she she shrugs and she's like, yeah, I'm probably gonna hate you for a while. This is a lot yeah. to deal with. On my own. I know how you feel. And it's shitty that I... You say you're gonna fix this? Yeah. I'm gonna fix it. Sure. Thumbs up. She nods. She says... Tomorrow... Uh, come back early in the morning. I need to show you something. 
before the kids wake up. Okay. Yeah, they should see it too. Okay. Down at Sugar. Want to stay here? Or do you want to come with? She does not let go. I'll be taking her. For... She nods. She's yeah. I mean, that's fine. Her night screaming wakes up the other kids. Shit, there's a degree to get hold. Um. Where are you going? We're probably gonna go stay in the vault and. Yeah, that'd be nice. Yeah. Which um, one are you staying at? Which one is. How many are there? Here, I know of. Uh. I mean, there's a, there's a ton. Because this is like a major city. Hmm. Uh, the one that you probably know best is the one that Atlas runs. Oh, yeah. Uh, we're gonna probably Atlas. Uh, she nods. She says, uh, just be here in the morning. I'll let you know if anything happens. I was gonna use up all your minutes. Don't have, Do you have any game. games. You have any games on your stuff? <laughs> oh, um, do we, Alicia? Do we have games? No, no, you don't. <laughs> but you, but we could put them on there. Is what you're saying? No, you can't. If we bother you enough, we might get them. Kind of pats her on the head. Oh, she hates it. Oh yeah, she does. If she wasn't so busy scarfing down food, she would have swatted. She, like, tries to dodge it. Uh, go over the sugar. Try to do the same thing, but no, she's not. Oh, to salt, you mean? Yeah, that's what I mean. Sorry. Yeah, salt sticks her tongue out at you and runs, but you can do it to pepper. Yeah. Get some on the bed. Uh, salt points and laughs at him. Tell him he's a mama's boy, and he looks embarrassed and kicks the ground a bit. He asks, "Are you, are you coming back?" Yeah, we'll be back tomorrow. Promise. Yeah. Thank you. Mom. Okay. He sticks out his pinky. Yeah, she does back. And yes, uh, anything else between the two of you you wanted to do? And Quinn, Quinn's also here. No, Quinn left for Kira. Oh, right, Quinn left for Kira. I, uh, well, I would have been like, okay, I'm gonna go make sure Kira doesn't fucking get eaten by a stack of books, willingly or not. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> just imagine her like seeing <laughs> man eating books and is like yes my body is ready and just runs to them or you know getting buried in them because she found so many books I'm just gonna make sure she actually sleeps tonight so we can do stuff tomorrow true where are we meeting Atlas, Atlas. hotel yeah. okay. uh, no, it's, it's called no. the honey pot yeah it's called the honey the pot the honey pot um okay so, that doesn't sound like a normal hotel. Just so you know, when you walk in, mm. don't scream. It's fine. Okay. Uh, like Kira. Yeah, I she'll... definitely need to go make sure Kira. Doesn't... Kira's gonna. Kira <laughs> might freak out, but it should be. Fun. <laughs> it's fun not telling you anything. So, <laughs> good luck. It's <laughs> fun. What? Uh, not telling good. you anything. So good luck. <laughs> You're so mean. I am. <laughs> Maple does say that, by the way. She's like, huh. 
Good luck. I do the same to you. Hmm? I do the same to you. It's funny. And I give her like a bro punch in the shoulder yeah, and leave. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I guess me and Iris are going. Iris looks fucking horrified, but yeah. It's it's fine. He's harmless. I mean, I'll take your word for it, but, um... Definitely gonna it's... be startling for you guys. Is it, like, how bad? Like, on a scale of 1 to 10, with 10 being, like, I, I, I don't know, bad. Like, really bad. Um... Probably 6. Startling, anyway. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I think. Sorry, give me one second. I'm having a problem. Oh, no problem. It's just me. Man. Just you. It is me. It is I. Happy. Mm -hmm. Oh. Oh, well, that's upsetting. Oh. What? Uh. I couldn't find the character I thought I had put in, so I was throwing him in real quick. And apparently, I've reached my quota. Yeah. Yeah. That's there's fine. A way, there's a way to get around that. I'm sure there is. Uh, Might I just have to go in and delete something old. No, not that. Um, I mean, for right e now. 5e e tools is. Uh... Yeah, I always put it in through 5e e tools. Yeah. Space. You can? Yep. Mm -hmm. I'll show you later. Okay. For now, you can just stick them in the, um... Yeah, I'll just stick them in the chat so you guys can see it, because it's Atlas. Uh, so you guys walk into the honey pot. Uh, it's a pretty generic kind of tavern. It's nice. Um, it's very warm and cozy. There's people laughing and messing around. It's not a high-end place, but it's uh, everyone here seems to be having a very good time. Mm -hmm. uh, as you guys are looking around uh, Maple, you hear a roar. Mm -hmm. Uh, as you turn and look at the bar, and you guys see a bear behind the counter. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Ooh, the honey pot. But, um, is it like a happy roar or like an upset roar, roar? What was it? Happy. Okay. Happy, I will. Uh, she kind of grins and like waves over at him. Hey, Atlas. Oh, I can't do bear noises. <laughs> <laughs> kind of look yeah. over at Iris, see what her reaction is. Uh, Iris is just like, just like staring, uh -huh. just like, like a mouth slightly agape, just like, all right, that's a bear. Oh, so, that was. That Six, right? Did I get that right? Yeah, no, that's that's for sure six, maybe a six point two. Um, okay, cool. can he? This 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 might be insensitive. Um, can he talk? Uh, not by no. Okay. okay ha, cool. I. It's, okay. <laughs> she walks over to the counter. <laughs> Iris bucket like follows in a daze. Uh, he gives another roar as you come near, and, uh, he, uh, he gestures to the cast behind him, asking, you know, what you want to drink. They all have very clearly labeled names on them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, none for right now. Actually, I was, we need to rent some rooms out. Two, look over at Iris. Two, two, one. Two, two, two should be good. 
Okay. Yep. Yeah. Two rooms. Uh, he gives a nod and he points over to the sign that has the pricing clearly mm -hmm. labeled. Mm -hmm. Uh, for two rooms, uh, that will just be, uh, that's actually only a silver. Basic. For, like, the standard basic rooms. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's for per night. So. Wait, one, two silver per room, or, sorry. Per, one silver. One silver. So yeah, I'm five gonna... copper, five copper room per night. Okay, I'm gonna give him four. He nods, uh, kind of like, you, you put it on the counter and he has to, like, brush it off the counter onto his paw. Mm -hmm. Cause he does not have thumbs, he's just a bear. Mm -hmm. Uh, and he, like, dumps it into a thing under the counter, uh, and fumbles for a bit, uh, pulling out a barely hooked, uh, two keys that he hands to you. Mm -hmm. Take them. Thanks. He points to Iris and makes another kind of... Oh, uh, this is Iris. Uh, Iris, it, that was... He it, puts it, his it, paw it, out for you to shake, and it is, like, the size of your face. I... I grab, like, his, like, little bear finger and, like, shake his hand that way, like... His paw? Yeah, whatever, fuck. <laughs> his bear finger. Listen. His bear finger. Uh-huh, 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 uh -huh. Look! Uh -huh. I... I... Fun. Look. I'm an idiot. We know this. We're moving oh, on. Oh, funny. Um, it's, it's, it's very nice to meet you. Thank you for your hospitality. I can't do bear noises. I hate this. Uh -huh. <laughs> you did this to yourself. I know. <laughs> kind of um, new to Echo, so. Uh, he, he gives a nod. Yeah, there's a few more coming, so I'm sorry if any of them scream. I think one might. He gives, like, kind of this shrug. Yeah. Points to a sign. Costs are doubled if you scream. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there is a sign that says, uh, not a trained bear, just a bear. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Now we're gonna go grab a tape. Yep. Uh, as you grab a table, you see a large group of guards are actually here. Uh, I'm back in L4, by the way. Just high key gonna say that right now. What'd you say? I'm back in L4. I'm not a changeling right now. Elf. Elf. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Uh, good. So you, you're back in L4. Uh, are you looking like your, your sister? Like her, but slightly different. Like ever so slightly. Okay. Uh, so you sit down with Iris at one of the tables, uh, a elven barmaid comes over to you to get your order. Uh, most of this place just seems filled with, like, work people, you know, farmers, uh, woods cutters, that kind of stuff. Like I said, there is, like, two tables pushed together that's filled with guards. Uh, they seem to be celebrating something. They're probably the loudest and rowdiest here, but they're not, like, causing any harm. Mm -hmm. Just kind of obnoxious. Mm -hmm. uh, you do notice looking at the guards that a fair amount of them seem to have been cursed in one way or another uh, one of the guys is purple yeah. just completely purple Hell yeah. uh, another guy seems who is an elf seems to have a tail like a fish tail oh great uh you see, uh, there, there's just a whole bunch of them. Not everyone, but probably more than you kind of remember some of the guards looking like. Mm -hmm. Gonna kind of stop the barmaid. Oh, I fucking, I knew I made him. 
You did make him. There he is. Yeah. I knew I made him in game. Ha 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 ha. I ha, love ha. him. <laughs> no, you don't. Um. Oh, the bear. Yes. Yes. You made him in game. Cool. Yeah, I was gonna say. Sorry. No, different person. Why I'm sorry. can't I love the bear? Uh, you do bear. see. Uh. On a stack of books. Ah, uh, there he on is. On one of the seats. There he is. You do see this guy. What? <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he has a thimble that he apparently is doing shots in. Amazing. Uh, gonna kind of stop the barmaid. Um, do you know what they're celebrating exactly? Um, oh, yes, uh, I believe Sir Ferdinand just got a promotion. Hmm. Great for him. Mm -hmm. Kind of gives, like, a kind of forced smile. Yes, uh, he'll be, uh, in charge of the guards for both inside the walls and outside. Oh boy, that's a quite a promotion. Oh, can I get uh, either of you anything to drink or eat? Uh, uh, can I get an ale? Of course. Uh, uh, make it two, please. Thank you. Uh, of course. Uh, house sale coming up. And she'll come back later with uh, ale that it has uh, honey and cinnamon in it. Ooh. Yeah. Um, uh, Maple, go do you sorry, go ahead. You go. Uh, Maple, do you know this Sir Ferdinand? Is it the tiny one? Yeah, is that is that him? It's the fucking tiny asshole. Um, yeah, he got cursed by some and now hates all the creatures. Changelings in numbers. Oh, that's so, not great. No. That's not great at all. No. The fact that he has control over now the outside too is kind of worrying. A lot more cursed guards. Than is there, I mean, I would have to think that they are quite common here in Echo. I is there that much prejudice again? Yeah. Uh, if you noticed walking area up here. Oh then get to that. That's so, that's stupid. Now he has over the guards in the area where I think he is. Do you want to add him to our hit list? <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, I'm down for murder. I saw him in like five seconds ago, <laughs> so like, yeah. He looks like a dick, it's fine. And he's a guinea pig, so like, who cares? Uh, not really high priority right now. Did it get a smile, though? Did it get it a did. small time? It did. Yes! <laughs> That's all I want. I wonder if he commands any cavalry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, when you hear him speak, it's like high pitched and squeaky. Did they? Oh my god! Did yeah. They? <laughs> they want All, right. All right, you fuckers! This is the greatest night. <laughs> yeah, basically, nice, nice, nice. This is Amazing. Incredible. <laughs> Alright, uh, let's jump over to Kira and, uh, Kira and Quinn. Okay. I roll up at the library 20 minutes later with two coffees. <laughs> sure, you roll up with fantasy Starbucks. I roll up with fantasy Starbucks. <laughs> Alright. Amazing. Great. 
you'd, you'd find me in the in the Avon section. I hand you your fantasy Starbucks. Okay. Uh, she goes in for a drink really quickly, which is probably too quickly. I would. Uh, I just got those. Ow. <laughs> she like starts cooling it down. <laughs> Magic. Ah, uh, thanks, Quinn. Yeah. Uh, we can't stay here too late because we gotta do shit in the morning. But I can help you look for shop. Oh well, um, Fred, I haven't had made much success so far. Do you think that that um that little boy can read at all? I'm sorry, what uh, was that? Do you think the little boy can read at all? I I didn't catch his name. The I mean, she'd describe. I think it's Pepper. Pepper. Yeah, right. Pepper. Uh, I mean, probably not. Okay. All right. Uh, I'll see if I can find an educational book for him then um, on how to actually read. You're, you're going to give him a book on how to read. Isn't that how uh, most people learn how to read? I suppose I. So you're just gonna hand him a book and tell him, "Good luck." Well, no, I. Look, I don't want him to become a cut purse, despite what you may be teaching him. I forgot so you were gonna... teaching the kids pickpocketing. Mm -hmm. I. If it's Cut's Purse or Dad, I'll take Cut's Purse every time. Of course. Uh, obviously. But... You only teach them one thing, they'll only learn one thing. Very okay. astute. <laughs> yes. Alright, we can look for a book to teach kids how to read. What did you understand? Um, so, um, is Maple okay? Uh, probably not, but I doubt she wants to talk to either of us about it. Um, all right, uh, suppose we can get back to looking then. Nods. Okay. And we we do a library. Do a library. Yep. Uh, roll me uh, an investigation again, but this time you can do advantage. <laughs> do I use my portent instead? I'm gonna use my portent instead. I'm not. I'm fucking sick of this. <laughs> uh, I get a nineteen. <laughs> Uh, so oh, nine no. plus what is it? No, it's nineteen. Nineteen. Okay. Plus your. Oh. It's fifteen plus four. Okay, got it. Okay. 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 Um, let's see, I wrote down the list of the stuff. A lot of these just are not in this library in particular. Uh, for okay. C, for the, for the C curses one. Uh, you do find you do find a book about different types of curses and diseases that has a brief part mentioning uh, so occasionally people do go down to the ocean to fish sea fish uh, wow how novel I mean it's extremely dangerous and usually only the richest of the rich can afford it. So there are... A party or something. But there are, like, some very strange diseases or curses that have been... Uh, I can't think of the right word for it, that have been cataloged from that. Yeah. 
uh mostly just like it's like a big medical slash arcane book about diseases and curses and it talks about some of these but it doesn't get too much into it it lists kind of symptoms uh what they've seen and kind of what has happened to some of these subjects okay that's a lot of big words i'm gonna leave you to that <laughs> he's gonna uh, wander off to a different section book later and i am looking for recent history of the city information okay uh also you can find a kid's book that it's a is for avondale oh my god <laughs> it's what's available i guess uh and for you quinn what were you looking for recent history of the city of the city echo yeah echo in general Sorry. but specifically Sorry. The city. uh yes the city to Sai. uh okay roll an investigation Fourteen? Yeah. Uh, you can find just a general book about the founding of Desai, how it was built. Uh, essentially, it didn't really become a big town because not a lot of elves wanted to live so close to the forest where the portal was uh, until the Avon Company formed, and they have to be close to it. So uh, that's kind of how the city really sprouted up. Great, so everyone here is going to kiss Avondale's ass. Possibly. It also describes kind yeah. of how the city is split up and stuff. I think I have it in the uh, the one thing about the different islands and countries and stuff, but it's essentially run by a parliament of aristocracy. Yeah. And I'm looking for mention of my family name, but I don't expect to necessarily actually find it. Uh, it would be mentioned briefly, just very, very briefly, uh, about them being disgraced. Okay. So yeah, I will come and sit back next to Kira and read my book. At some point I'll get up and get a directory. I'm looking at the address of my family's estate. Yeah, uh... Your mom had a general idea of where it was, so it's not too hard to find it. I go to the big you are here map on the wall. At some point <laughs> you would ask, like, what, what are you looking for? Just information about where we're at, my family and shit. Oh. You have family here? Hello. I'm sorry, no, you're cutting out for me a lot. Oh, I'm it sorry. It might be on my end. I no, I it's... Oh, is it? Never mind. I didn't hear it, but... No, I got... I have... Okay, red connectivity. Oh. Because fuck me, I guess. Um... Not the library, god. Sorry. Uh... <laughs> it's, it's rapidly switching between green and red, so I don't... I don't know when one would be a good time to say. Um, tonight, is, just tonight is cursed. Um, oh, mine's switching randomly, too. Yeah, maybe we should switch servers. Mine's been doing that the entire time. Let's switch oh. servers. I don't know how to change it. Um, where do I change it to? I'll do it. I'll do it. I'd do it, but I don't know if I can do it on mobile. I probably can. Mm -hmm. Uh, where are we going? Let's go. Oh, where are we? Yeah. Hello. 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 Mine's consistently Mine's yellow consistent. right now. Oh no, it's green. It's green. green. I mean, like I haven't had any trouble hearing any of you. Okay. Um. Yeah, so basically, okay. yeah, it's like, you have family here? Yeah, they abandon us. Damn. I'd like to pay him a visit before we go. 
Um, are you sure that's a good idea? I promised my mom. And they abandoned you and your mother? Yeah. They basically used her and all her siblings to get out of Echo. Not Echo. Mirai. Wait. What? How? How, how does that work? That's crazy. Quinn explains the political social issues of the lower reach. <laughs> <laughs> so elves aren't considered adults till like a hundred. Okay. So they don't incur debt. They basically had the kids oh. work off and pay off their debt and then bounced. Holy shit. Okay. Especially because elves only need to sleep four hours a day. Right. So they had the kids working everything except those four hours. So if you raise your child as a work machine. Yes. If you have a bunch of kids and then do that. God, that's fucked up. Yeah, and he explains how um, her parents and all her older siblings got out and left her to rot in the dust with the newborn. <laughs> I didn't realize it was so preferential to elves. Yeah. The system's right. fucked. Yes, yes, we should pay them a visit, then. <laughs> pay them a beating? <laughs> Out of character, I don't think Quinn tells Kira this quite yet. Uh, Mom told me to egg the place. So that's what we're gonna do. Rad. <laughs> that would be like really therapeutic for like everyone right now. <laughs> Kira would be like, "Oh man, we're gonna do a crime." <laughs> oh, Kira, didn't her. you commit arson? Yes. <laughs> I asked if, okay, she did not commit arson. Arson happened. Okay. Um, <laughs> When you have to make that distinction, I feel like you're already too far. Yes. <laughs> Although, Kara did petty crime for a very brief period of time. So. She did a petty crime. <laughs> oh man, um, Kira's hardcore. She did one crime. She jaywalked. <laughs> Some, someone saw how stuck up she was. and Queen. They were like, I will give you five gold to jaywalk. Cl clearly... <laughs> Her heart is set that you should follow the law, right? Uh-huh. It works fine every time. Smile. We'll, we'll break you of that terrible habit yet. Um, but yeah, we do, we, do, we do a research. Yep. Uh, Quinn tries to get them out of there at a normal person time. So Not done. For, Quinn, for Quinn, that's like one, maybe. I, I know, we got to do shit in the morning, though. We come back. The library's not going to explode. But you brought me coffee. Yeah, because I didn't think I could sneak all dinner in. Also, I it's 1 a.m. Oh, I'm starving. Yeah. <laughs> That's a mood. <laughs> yeah, we can get shit at the bar or hotel. Oh, oh, uh, Maple said, to stay? yeah, Maple said, don't scream. Don't, what? <laughs> don't, just, I, I don't know. Don't scream. Just don't fucking I don't, scream. I don't, I don't usually scream. Why would I scream? <laughs> I, she does scream, so. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, uh, so you guys go into the honey pot. Uh, Why would I scream? <laughs> and you see a large uh, brown bear behind the counter. Kira screams, Quinn's like, ah, called it. <laughs> he like points to the sign. Not a trained bear, just a bear. I wave at him. He so, waves back. I get up and go like Are you guys just still sitting down there? Probably it's waiting, yeah. Uh, no, well. We're just waiting. <laughs> Sorry. I mean, Mabel probably asked Iris to take um, sugar from see if she could sleep. She eventually falls asleep holding on to you so you could, like, detach her and take her up to a room. Yeah. Yeah. 
you know, as you do. I, I go up to the bear and get us two rooms and dinner right, and ales. Okay. Oh. Hey, got rooms. Okay. Um. Cool. I so pack the rooms in. I'll just get the dinner and the ale. Hey. He roars and uh, slides you a menu, so you can choose the food and stuff. I choose two of the most exotic looking item on there. Okay. They have this weird thing called salmon. Oh my god, what is this? Fuck, <laughs> I love salmon. I bring here a plate of salmon. Yeah, they have this weird uh, stuffed salmon. You've never heard of this. It says it's some kind of fish, which is also very rare in Mirai. It's, it's really weird. Like, what the fuck you know, is this? I imagine Kira's probably had fish at least once. Yes. I because think... money. Um, <laughs> the only reason it's okay. exotic is because Quinn's there a broke bitch. <laughs> flying fish. Yes, but yes, I suppose that's true. Uh, but the salmon is a freshwater fish. Well, actually, the salmon here are fresh ocean and sky. They're like a whole fucking mix. But mm-hmm. hell yeah. Anyway, uh, they are not really usually over in Mirai. Uh, they're more over here, so... Or an import. Yeah, so you could definitely have had it. Quinn, no. Salmon, oh. just, it's like, oh, oh, what's this? Oh, I mean, salmon's okay. Oh. So- sorry, I figured you didn't want to go talk to the bear. Well, um... I mean, if she was asked, like, like It's Salmon! Oh yeah, salmon's okay. Um, yeah, you're right. I I really. He looks slightly Why is there a bear? Uh, he's just chilling, man. Because uh, Yellen's the place. He's a bear. Yeah. <laughs> and you're a person. Oh my god. <laughs> You're a person? I didn't realize you're a person. I don't know if, if this is normal. Yeah. But... I mean, there's a guinea pig over there drinking yeah, like, uh, I mean, shots. Like, literally, she just points over towards the group of them. Yeah, this is pretty fucking normal if you look over there. I thought bears were, you know, like... Dangerous. It stinks. <laughs> stinks. The guinea pig is super drunk. The guinea pig is super drunk. <laughs> yeah. Um, hey, where's Nadinia? No, I did not answer. <laughs> oh, I, I, I stopped trying to text her after like 30 minutes of, hey, hey. where you at? Hey. But hey. unlike Kira, I'm less concerned about her being whisked away by a fake. I mean, that's the phase problem. She... she... Wow. Wow. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm gonna phone Jack. He's probably with him. That Jack makes sense. One. Uh he let's jump to Chris and then I'll have him answer well. Yeah. Uh, so Chris, you guys go play poker. Mm-hmm. Uh he, he bounces between stuff because he doesn't want to be too suspicious, but he basically tries to lead you to uh, poker, darts, uh, and there's also uh, some dice games going on. Mm-hmm. You win everything you play. Mm-hmm. At least that's luck-based. Yay! Because I'm awesome. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's what that means. Uh, roll me... Roll me a perception check. Perception check. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh. Atlas, Sir Ferdinand, I'm sorry, but you guys gotta... You guys gotta move out of the way so I can get to me. <laughs> did you leave them up? <laughs> yeah, they look awesome. What did you... I mean, he wasn't rolling or anything. That's fair. 
Yeah, that's about right. Okay. Um. Yeah. You're kind of busy with, uh, you know, playing these games and stuff. Uh, not really paying too much attention to some of the people around you. Everyone seems pretty good-natured about everything. Uh, there's a couple people that are kind of sore losers, but they still divvy oh, out the gold. all our money. <laughs> <laughs> How long do you play for? Yes. Hours? Yeah, just... It, just okay enough until until jack might tell me uh this is this is enough for a wyvern yeah he i mean he definitely tries to pause it out like he he wants to make sure you guys don't get caught mm -hmm. so oh, like, yeah no I, i'm following his lead definitely yeah so he me. takes he takes longer breaks uh when people lose he buys them drinks mm -hmm. so they get like drunk and yeah, not cheating, Can, but I have, it would be... No one's going to play with you then. I have a question. Um, is mm -hmm. there a way to make it so that, like, I can use my luck in the opposite direction? To make yourself unlucky or other people unlucky? To, to make myself, like, lose if I really wanted to lose. Uh, you could try saying a prayer to Istis and seeing if that worked. Or you could just not follow your gut. That's true, you could do the exact opposite of what you, uh... Feel well, I mean, right. and that only works so far. I, I would right. say probably doing a prayer to Istis would be your best bet. Hey, like... Istis, don't let me get caught cheating. So, throw me a bad hand. Yeah, that, that's <laughs> pretty much... That's pretty much how I how I'd phrase it. Thank you. Yeah, every every so often, uh, you just get absolute shit. Aw, oh, man. Uh, oh, it definitely. I'm so unlucky. It definitely does help uh, with suspicions. Uh, it also helps that Jack is kind of losing next to you. Mm -hmm. And you guys are clearly, you know, together and uh, hanging out. We're not together. What are you talking about? We don't do that kind of thing. What? <laughs> <laughs> you didn't. No one said anything, and you didn't have to. Uh, <laughs> little <laughs> jumped on that real quick. Okay. <laughs> God. Um. He also buys you drinks and stuff. Uh, but after. Uh, after a long while, he gets a call from uh, you, Jamie. Yep, yes. Uh, he picks it up and he, he says, "Hey, what's up, boss?" Boss. I mean, yeah. Is that? I'm sorry. Is that? <laughs> no, I just wasn't expecting that. Um, is the TNU with you? Yeah, yeah, uh, we've been, uh, playing a bit. Oh? Mm hmm Playing, huh? Cards. Uh-huh. <laughs> sure. Listen, I wish it's cards. <laughs> <laughs> um, we're staying at the honey pot. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, I know where that place is. Yep, I think we're almost done here. Okay. Yep. <laughs> we'll catch ya. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, bye. I'll have her back home by curfew. Huh? Curfew was two hours ago! <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, hangs up. Yep. Uh, he turns to you, Nadinia. Uh... And he does, like, some quick mental math, and he's like, all right, I think one more hand and we should be good. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. 
Uh, so you play and, one more hand. Uh, and by the way, this whole time she's just been like having basically the time of her life. Yeah. Just like very ecstatic and happy to be doing something kind of reminiscent of mm -hmm. what she what she would normally be doing. No, I get you. Uh, roll, uh, roll either a perception or insight. Another one. Uh, do, 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 do. uh, give me a second because apparently I disconnected from the server. <gasps> uh -huh. uh, 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 <clears throat> Chicken? Job squad. Alright, there we go. Uh, Nadine. Character sheet. Said perception or insight, right? Yep. Um, I'm gonna actually go with insight. Will it be different based on, like, which one I pick? Yes. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna go with Insight. Oh. <laughs> Good job, me. <laughs> um, yeah, you, you don't notice the people who are playing with you on this last one seem pretty drunk at this point. Uh, seem rowdy and stuff. You do note that one of the guys with you is a changeling. Like, he is he is not disguising himself at all. That's cool. Yeah. Uh, the people around him don't seem to mind too much. There might be a couple people off to the side, but mm -hmm. uh, he, he seems really, really chill. And when he... When they all lose, they pay up uh jack buys them a round of drinks for their troubles and uh he motions that you guys should you know head out skadoodle yeah do a skadoodle all right i will we will skip town yeah uh as you guys walk out uh he looks over at the wyvern there Mm -hmm. And he says, uh, what, one moment, and he's going to walk over to it. You see him pull something out of his uh, pocket, and he scrawls something, uh, attaches it by the stable, and heads back to you. Mm -hmm. And he's like, all right. Uh, you know, uh, Echo can be pretty confusing, a little hard to navigate. And he offers you his arm. He says, to make sure we don't get separated. Okay, so she takes it and she is pointedly not looking in his direction. Okay, let's go. As you wish, Captain. And he, you know, uh, starts walking with you. Uh, he chats a bit about Echo. Like, I think mm -hmm. I mentioned before, he's been there. Uh, He's been there a couple times, so he just points out different different stores, different places. Uh, he points out there's actually like a cat cafe that mm -hmm. he gets super excited about. It's closed right now, but he's like, he gushes as you guys pass it. Uh, but yeah, he'll point out a couple nice places for... Uh, armor for weapons all this kind of stuff and eventually he leads you uh to the honeypot and he says uh oh uh don't worry about the uh the bartender what about the bartender and he leads you inside stare at the bear man <laughs> Just there. 
Can I pet him? I don't know if anyone's asked. Kind of, kind of walk over to 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 bear. Mm -hmm. Can I, can I pet you? The bear tilts its head at you, and it goes like, Rawr! and it just offers out its arm. Excuse me, man, my own human. <laughs> oh my god. He's so soft. He conditions every day. <laughs> He's so soft. How do you make your fur so soft? <laughs> How do I understand bear? You don't. Don't. Uh, got it. You change to a gnome, and you don't want that. If I, uh, if I know all animals. languages, do I know bear? No. How it's not a language. How, how insulting. I know it's useless. Just get rid of it. Wow. Garbage power. <laughs> Garbage <laughs> power. I can't speak to bears. You're out of pin. Let's just try again. <laughs> Can I can I re-roll for it into bear? <laughs> like your character? N n no, what? No, that's not what I was talking about. You want to fuck the bear? No, what? No. <laughs> you want to be a bear that fucks a bear? Yeah. Nice. Wow, guys, yes. we're really we're tired. <laughs> Versa, are you still alive? Nope. No, I am. I just had to listen. I yes, I am. My phone was very far away, and I had to grab it and push to talk. I am awake. I am alive. Nadimi wants to fuck a bear. We're That's all fine. Not... <laughs> <laughs> that is not what I said. None of that is what I happened. Hmm. Hmm. All right. Yeah. Yeah, so you guys see uh, Jack and Nadinia come in, and Nadinia just bolts for the bear. <sighs> so, uh, how many rooms you get? Two. Um, Do we need I, more? I was gonna, that's why I was gonna get more. I figured. Okay, I sure. mean, well, I mean, there's like six of us and a child. Yeah, I'm not used to buying rooms. And uh, I'd good. say at least one more. I can dump, double up a Jack and you and Iris and here and Nadina. I, I'd probably be best off on my own. I'll, I'll, I'll just that. Okay. I look at her. Don't run off to the library. Why would I do that? I don't know what you're talking about. Does does she know what I'm talking about? Yes. <laughs> I, I give her a look. Jack will come over to you guys. Hey, Jack. Hey, hey Rumi. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Unless you're getting some. <clears throat> no. No, it's probably for the best. I think it'd freak her out more if we were rooming together. Thumbs up. Yeah. I go by Jack and I a room. She, she, she's trying her best, okay? No, he's he is respectfully taking it slow. You said five copper for the night? Yes. Yeah. Good. Yeah, they aren't the nicest rooms and they're like two single beds well it's either two single beds or it's one big bed if you push it together why would I push it together huh hmm. big bed I get a big puddle, bed puddle puddle <laughs> oh my god puddle puddle I'm, I'm just saying that that's your options for it 
I put my little robot outside of Kira's door. To God, her did you from bring going the robot? <laughs> yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> Apparently <It's so>. <laughs> I set it outside her door. Okay. I, make her, I make its eyes glow so it looks like it's keeping watch. Okay, it, it won't do anything. So. <laughs> no, of course not. Quinn's <laughs> logic. God. Uh, <laughs> Kira is not, in fact, a toddler. So, who's rooming together? So is Jack and Quinn. Apparently, Nadine gets her own room because Kira is being lame. Yeah, I mean, just me. <laughs> so, wait, are you guys getting four rooms? Apparently. I guess. Okay. Get my own room, because... Okay. Because. Um, I mean, it'll be the first time you slept in your own room in a long time. Well, since we got the ship, yeah. I mean, you that. don't... Yeah, before that. And yes, before that, I suppose. But every time we do, do get our rooms all spread, I do recall that is a thing I do. Have there been other places? No. Why? Never mind. That's one of the characters. Why? <laughs> Why? Why have we never stayed in a hotel before? Yeah, it's not like we have free room. Look, I'm sorry. <laughs> I see. I you're sorry. Think. Sorry for that, but not about calling me an idiot before. Wow. Um, while we're downstairs, I think uh, I think she would ask, like, is everything okay at um, home? To uh, basically uh, to, to Mabel, like, how many of those words are correct for me to say? Um, so she kind of looks around at the noisy bar and then kind of gestures for Quinn and Kira to get like a bit closer so they can take like her. Oh, okay. Taken by Gabe on and that hurt. Kids were there. I imagine you knew these people well, huh? I take it. I I be not a lot of kids that are there. So we have to rescue two people. No, Sugar is upstairs and Vic is dead. Oh, Quinn just nods, displeased. I don't think anyone ever told her that that was sugar. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, I'm sorry to hear that. I still have his body. I still have it. Well, we'll kick their teeth in and get it back. Yeah. Yeah, we'll get it back. Um. Yeah, we're gonna go. Oh. Oh, okay. All right, that must be the thing that you mentioned we have to do in the morning. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Speaking um, of which, I'm gonna go to bed. Yeah, yeah, go, go to bed. Yeah. Good night. Hmm? Going to be around the city. Who Who's in my room? No one. No one. Help out. Nobody? Oh. Sorry, what'd you say? I was wondering who was in my room, and it was nobody, right? Kira doesn't want to sleep with you. Oh. 
I could be Jack if you want. Yeah, I mean, I'll take the solo room. You want to sleep with Jack? Go for it. I I know this is going to sound weird, but eventually she does come into, like, go knock on, uh, uh, the boys' room? <laughs> yeah. And, uh, Dick Jack will answer it. Hey, don't be weird about this. It's really, like, quiet in my room. Don't be weird about this. <laughs> so, guys, mind if I just chilled here until maybe Kira gets back? What? I, I'm Kira. Kira didn't go anywhere. She just got her own room. Oh, not Kira gets back until it just until like later, maybe. So you guys actually go to sleep? Yeah. I mean, I don't... Quinn, do you mind? What? Okay. <laughs> if Quinn was more awake, he'd be upset because he realized... Because for the first time in, like, forever, he's actually sleeping in his boxers instead of actual pants because he shares a room with a girl normally. Hmm. But he's a half asleep, so he just rolls over. <laughs> <laughs> And she just kind of just chills out there. Yeah, uh, he'd offer that you can sit on the bed, because there really isn't any other place, and he'll lean against the No, no, the no, wall. It's, you're, you're, it's fine, you're fine. Just, it's been really weird not having someone in the room often because it is usually it's it's usually him and oh shit he's trying to go to sleep no he's asleep no. oh, okay. <laughs> do you want me in the room i mean I... I figured you you know didn't no it, it it's not that i don't it I don't know. I won't. Does it... I, I'm I'm trying not to be weird about it. So, if you don't mind, of course. Okay. Night, Quinn. Night. Good night. <laughs> Fuck you. Well, that was I weird. see some favoritism. <laughs> He'll grab his stuff, move over to yours. Uh, he doesn't put the beds together. <laughs> Don't move my bed! <laughs> no, no. In, in the genius room, there's still two beds. Oh, yeah. he's going over there. Yes. yes. I understand. Yes. He doesn't put the beds together. Uh... He just kind of plops down on one. Mm -hmm. uh, and he's, he, he kind of rubs the back of his neck and he's like, uh, Nadine, I'll, I'm just going to say, it. you. I hope it's been clear that I do like you. It's been Crystal. Yes. Okay. Um, you don't need to tell me if you like me or anything like that. Uh, but just let me know what you're comfortable with. I don't want to push that. No, you've been fine. It's mostly been... Me? I just... I don't know. I'm not very... I hate a lot about myself, so it's really weird when you're trying to, like, 
compliment me about things and it's really it's really weird and I, I the, the last person that was really doing that was my is the captain and so the last and so it really sounds like the captain complimenting me and they it, I know it's a really weird mental space and I, I I'm gonna stop uh I mean I'm I'm not planning on stopping complimenting you because I think you deserve it uh but if there's anything I can do to help. I. Maybe I just need to compliment you enough that you only associate it with me. I. Jack, I really appreciate it. There's been a lot of things happening recently. And, uh, she, like, she, like, turns around and kind of pulls, like, her, 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 uh, it shows off, like, the mark, essentially. Mm -hmm. And is like, this thing is happening and I'm I, I know magic when I, I when I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to know magic and whoa Nadinia, that doesn't look he like gets up and looks at the mark thing and he's like is that like infected or something it's a pretty valid question what what do you mean there's just a mark there no like the Fuck. the skin around it is that a bad tattoo? <laughs> Are you now taking what? care of it? Jack, Jack, what does it look like? Uh, squishy, moist. Dania, like, there's a mirror in the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's not gonna help it's like it, uh, it, but I mean she does go and tries to look at it mm -hmm. and uh can I see it yes it is like an inch around the mark now I freeze stop turn around smile very very gently and politely and say one moment Jack Scream. uh okay and I'm going and she's going to exit the room okay and uh go to where Quinn was okay And she's oh. going to gently and politely knock on the door. I'd like to remind you that I was also there when we... At, you're not here. I you're mean, I'm in, a I'm in another room. Oh, she, it's, it's, she'll, she's going to throttle both of you. Okay, good. Okay, I was just making sure I got what came with me. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> uh. Oh god, though. Okay. He answers the door in a minute. Hey! Hi! 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 I thought you were still my roommate. And she, and she, very gently, but firmly, takes him by the shoulder and says, Come with me, please. Okay. Can I put on, I don't know, something? No, 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 no need. You won't. You won't need that. Okay. Just like fucking murder you. He he's not wearing his armor or anything. Cause why would he sleep with that? I don't know. It appears that she's about to hit one motherfucker with another motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, she goes to Kira's room. 
Okay. Yeah. And she gently and politely knocks on the door. There's a robot in front of it. <laughs> Is that yours? Yeah. You might want to pick that up. And put it where? And in your pocket? I don't know. I'm standing here in my boxers. <laughs> Again, not my problem. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, it takes a a pregnant pause. Shut up. <laughs> Jeez, Kira's getting some too. My God. <laughs> My vocabulary it has gotten me into trouble again. Um, <laughs> yeah, it takes all it does, her, bud. her a minute, and she comes to the door with without her glass on. Nadine. All right. Good evening. Can I come in for a second? Um, it looks like Quinn a little bit, but you can't see anything. Uh, sure. Of Good. course. Do you need something? Yes, I, do. I need to talk to the both of you. Together. We're gonna get our ass whooped. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> do, you, do you let her in? Yeah, yeah, I, 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 like, step off to the side. And, you know, I still have my hand on her, uh, on Quinn's shoulder, and as, uh, as she enters, uh, she places one on Kira's shoulder, and then very firmly pushes you guys towards, like, the wall that had the door. Uh. <laughs> this is fun. And she, she, she's got like, you know, the faint eye twitch. Did what is hap what is happening to my mark? Oh, uh, oh, it's, okay. Thank I, you. I don't know. We were telling you it's like the Arcanus dude or whatever. I thought you were going to kill us. Yeah, I super can't cast magic right now, just so you know, Kira. If we die, we die. <laughs> we die, we die. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> well, I doubt Kira's got what? her spell book on her right now. She... It's, in my, it's in my pocket. Of course I do. Oh, I okay. that. What is happening to my mark? We don't know. Trying to find we're trying out. To, you, know, you didn't seem particularly interested when we told you. Why didn't you tell me that it was rotting on me? I don't think it's rotting. Because it's gonna fucking freak you out. I don't think it's rotting. Just more like um, it's been underwater for way too long. I think it. I think it. I think it's turning you into something. But uh, uh, that's just a theory. Quinn, Quinn also, I will say, like, it I is more like seen. rotting than just being underwater for too long. Okay, fair. I thought I she was turning into a squid, me. but... <laughs> she turned yeah. into a squid. It's like a little slimy. Yeah, I, like, that, that's that's what gets no, hot. Can, can I see it again? Yes, you guys see it, and it is definitely bigger. Mm, so, uh, it wasn't this big before. And I poke it. Uh, uh, can I go get my glasses? I can't yeah, see. Yeah, when you poke it, it, like, goes in a bit and it leaves that like an indent of your finger oh like like do you release her to let her get your glasses <laughs> no here it's getting worse <laughs> oh no um so look. i'm going to go back to bed and I'm going to pretend like I'm going to go to sleep. I'm probably not going to um, go to sleep. Next time that there is something happening to me, could you do me a favor? Look, look if you give me an hour, I can put you to sleep. Could you do me 
of faith. I didn't want to worry you. I'm sorry. Could you not hide that from me? Thank you. Crystal clear. All right. <laughs> and she lets go. And she opens the door and closes it gently. Goes back to the room. Opens the door. Is she like taking Quinn with her? <laughs> no. Let, okay. let, let's go with both of you. Okay. She like runs over and gets her glasses. Uh, and, 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 and opens the door. Closes the door. Goes over to Jack. And just starts bawling. Oh, oh. Uh, Jack was playing with the calico kitten. Uh, when you walked in. He's like, hey, is everything all... Oh. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. He, he, like, he he gets you sitting on the bed and kind of tries to pull you into a hug. Pats your back. There, there. And, and like, like, the, 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 there's just a stream of words, but the thing that comes out the most is, I'm rotting and I can't get rid of it. I I have some salve for tattoos. I I it should help. <laughs> what? Cries harder. Cries. Okay. Cries a lot. He, I I can bandage it up. Nods gently. Okay. Okay. Uh. He's got a bunch of tattoos, uh, mm -hmm. so he pulls out like this kind of basically a lotion. Mm -hmm. He applies it to the, and he kind of like wraps it around uh, your neck so it's covered. Mm -hmm. And he's like, "There, that that should help." Everything okay? It's okay. And uh, at this point, she 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 is going to confide everything that has happened since the probably since the moment she like she like almost died. Okay, so you tell him about the sea elves. Yeah, yeah, I tell him everything. That's what I'm trying to plan this, and then <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's he's gonna sit there and listen. He asks a couple clarifying questions, but for the most part, he is silent uh, as he listens to the whole thing. Uh, when you get to the end, he kind of, he's like, oh, oh, wow, that is, that's a lot to process. Oh, heck, oh, oh, oh darn. It's like, uh, that's, that's a lot to process, but uh, it, it it's, it's okay. It's going to be all right. I mean, you're. It, it, it's okay. You're chosen of Istis. I mean, you're fated for everything to work out. I think that's how it works. Why are you so positive? A good captain should be. It's easy to be negative, and you gotta stay positive so your crew can stay positive. I'm a terrible captain. No, that's not. Oh god. <laughs> L listen. Oh, wow, you've activated my trap card. <laughs> listen, listen. It's... There are times I'm not optimistic. I'll be. I'll be completely honest. All right. But it's. In by yourself is one thing, with your crew is another, okay? And you don't seem to let all of this interfere with how you deal with your crew. That's a good captain. Thank you. I'm a handful. 
I got two hands. Wow, Alicia. Just had that already. Smooth operator. <laughs> Do you want the kitten tonight? Please. Here you go. Choose a bed hog. <laughs> she can have all the beds. I mean, I guess that means you have to be in mine. Okay, I'm getting in this bed now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm messing with you. Good night. It's gonna be go okay. To and she will go to sleep. Uh, Jack passes out instantly. Yay! Sorry Anything it took so long, guys. <laughs> That's good. Anything for tonight? And then we're gonna call it, uh, for tonight. Yeah. Uh, I guess Kira would, like, say to, to Quinn, like, Okay, we're gonna go tomorrow to the library and we're gonna find out how to fix this, okay? Yeah, yeah, okay. And he's just standing there, covered in scars, in his boxers, missing an what arm. What happened to your body? I was in an explosion. I, I, I lost an arm, he points. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Right, of course. Um, it, it hurt a lot. Um, it looks yeah. Like it did. yeah. Th thanks. Uh, I'm gonna not be here anymore. <laughs> <laughs> like, as she's like, kind of like looking inappropriately closely at all of his scars. Like, there's oh, one yeah. on his leg that cuts through what probably used to be a tattoo. Now what it's just it? a smear of ink. Oh, okay. It was not a good tattoo. <laughs> Nick Tatty gave him that tattoo. Oh it, my it god. May have, it may or may not have been distinguishable before there was a scar through it. Nice. Um, I, of course. Um, I, yeah. in, unless you want to continue to, I don't know, undress me with your eyes. Stop! <laughs> <laughs> There's not that much there to undress. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm gonna... I'll see you in the morning, Kara. Awesome. Kara does not sleep. Okay. She's going just... to the library. She's thinking about the <laughs> lovely sight she got. Not... Are you sneaking out to go to the library? Hell yeah. Okay. There's a can... robot sitting by your door. Yeah. <laughs> Baby, it. stop it. Because it has no bearing on my actions. <laughs> it cannot it stop me. You knock it over leaving and it just wiggles on the ground. <laughs> oh, no, my robot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well. Uh, but yes, we can cover that in campfire stuff. Yeah, I mean, she's probably just going to go to the library and immediately pass out from exhaustion, but, you know. You could get more fantasy stuff. <laughs> no, I don't. I, I, I like that. I like the idea that Kira goes to the library. I'm gonna do shit. Sleep. Yeah. Oh no. Definitely not the first time she slept that way. What? All right. No, sorry. One of my cats kept coming over and meowing, so I was petting him. So we went meow, and then the second one came over, and I was like, "Oh no, I can't You're do anything." Poorly. <laughs> Um, why do they hate me? Why don't they come love me when we're playing? That's uh, a great question, because they always bother me. I just Razzle sort of was... sat on my keyboard while we were playing, so... Razzle was clawing my legs! Wow. <laughs> Mother, please! I cannot, I cannot say my dog's name while we play. <laughs> okay, so Muffin. Muffin yes. will do that. Um... What do Iris and Maple talk about yeah. as they have their bedroom with their sleeping child? Gay. Gay. But yeah, <laughs> yeah, no. point. Gay. No, no, I think that 
they, I mean, Iris wouldn't, like, bring shit up because, like, delicate time for everybody. So, mm-hmm. like, she would just, like, be chill uh. and not try to, like, hey, hey, she fucking lost her, like, brother. I'm not going to try and fuck. Like, that's <laughs> not no, just saying it's a child in the room. I was Jesus. just saying it was gay that it's you two in there with the kid. That, I wasn't that's saying not necessarily it was, like, gay. I mean, that's I mean... gay. Why has it got to be gay? Oh my God. Why can't it be bi? Because they're gay. Because <laughs> they're gay. <laughs> Why can't it be bi, though? Because because Maple's not bi. <laughs> She's gay. <laughs> All right, you're right. You, you, win, you win this round. Thank you. you win this round. Oh, my God. There's no anyway. rounds to be won. What? <laughs> Anything what? from you, uh, Maple? Uh, no, she would have just gone. I'm assuming uh, that you had sugar in your bed, right? Mm-hmm. Like a reasonable person. She she cuddles up to you. Second you get in. She doesn't wake up. She's, like, dead asleep. She will wake up screaming in the night. Ah, uh, she actually doesn't. Okay. You think she might wake up a couple times, like, panting? Uh, but you being there seems to calm her down. I've recently started having nightmares that are, like, that, and they're not fun. They are not. Did I ever tell you guys about the time I gave myself sleep paralysis for like three months? <laughs> I was giving myself sleep paralysis. Uh, it's because I kept listening to or reading scary stories I found online. Yeah. Well... And if I did that close to late at night, which I always did, I'd have sleep paralysis. Wow. That's awful. Way to go, buddy. Powerful imagination. <laughs> Took me three months to finally figure that out. <laughs> oh, what shit. is happening to me? Oh, wait. It's nightmare fuel I'm consuming. Man, I keep... I was. I mean, I was fully... Because I didn't know it was happening. I was just fully convinced that... Uh, someone kept breaking into my room. Every night. Like, some oh horrible... My God. Supernatural thing was in my room. I had, like... I was in college at the time, so I didn't really have anything to defend myself. I had like an exacto knife oh, that no. I kept by my <laughs> that oh I kept in god. the dresser by my bed. <laughs> my god. What the fuck are you doing? Yeah, I think Yes. We're yes, calling it for tonight. Yep, we are good for tonight. Uh, if you guys want to do anything else, uh, there's always campfire. Yeah. Uh, I will say that Maple, you would know when she talked about early, she meant like right before okay. dawn. Yeah. Yeah. Do we level up? No. So we're gonna wake up real early, and I'm gonna be like, "Where the fuck is Kira?" Yeah. I'm sorry. I'm like this. And then I'm gonna have to go to the library. It's, good. it's breakfast. I'm gonna be upset. Guys, I slept with Jack. I didn't. No, he left. What? what? Didn't he leave? No. 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 Okay, never mind. I'm just. He an passed idiot. out. Anyway. Okay. Okay. I am. Um, he gave me the calico, Jack. Ending the book. Yeah. Mm. Right. Names.